Hi, I'm Brian Van from Sport Bike Track Gear, SportBikeTrackGear.com. Today we're going to do a video review on the Alpine Stars SP1 one-piece leather suit. We're going to begin with a note on sizing. In our experience, the SP1 runs one size larger than marked. I am wearing a size 54 euro, 44 US. I'm 5 feet 11 inches tall, 200 pounds, and mildly athletic build, and I have on my Knox large race contour back protector and Knox padded shorts underneath the suit right now. Let's give you a forward facing view. I'd like to point out that you can see when I'm standing, I've got a little additional material here in the knee, okay, and it needs to be there. We're going to show you why right now. Remember, these suits are designed to be in this position right here, the riding position. You can see how nicely now that knee forms. Reach for the controls. The suit moves great on my body. Back. And then now, back to front. Let's talk about the materials that go into the SP1 suit. The leather, Alpine Stars uses in all their garments, is tested for abrasion and tear resistance by Alpine Stars. It's 1.2 to 1.4 millimeters thick in this suit here, the SP1. The stretch material you see in the suit is the Kevlar base, the high-end stuff. The Kevlar base stretch material offers a higher abrasion and tear resistance. In the SP1, we have it here from the wrist all the way to the underarm, and they have an additional panel here in the chest area of the suit. What's nice about that is if you're developed in the upper body, that stretch material in this area can help move the suit out and just keep it more comfortable for you. Stretch, same stretch material carries on to the crotch and the back of the legs. One of the things that we love about the SP1 suit is its simplistic design. Okay, One of the indicators of that designer you'll see here for the arm. Two large panels here. Upper arm, lower arm. That is very durable and protective when they don't use multiple pieces of leather. When they use just single pieces, it tends to hold up better, especially in multiple crashes. The SP1 also uses an accordion stretch panel here in the elbow, and you can see how easily my arm moves in the suit as that panel stretches out. Perforation from the SP1. Tons. The entire upper torso fully perfed. Perforation all the way down to just above the stretch panel in the knees. We've kind of shown you already the stretch panel in the knees, large stretch panel there. It allows the suit to move well on your body. My opinion of this suit is it's truly one of the best values in the Alpine Star catalog. I love the simplistic design because it offers a ton of protection and a ton of durability. This has kind of been a go-to suit for us because it fits many body types very well through the unique stretch panels that it uses like the one here in the chest area. The SP1 is definitely one of our favorites right now. Let's move on to part two. I'm going to show you from the inside out. Okay, here we go. The armor that's used in the SP1 is the Alpine Star CE certified proprietary armor, hard outer GP shell, energy absorbing foam on the inside. That's our elbow and forearm. Move on to our knee and shin. I love the knee and shin armor that Alpine Star uses. Here's the knee cup. You can see how it kind of wraps around the knee, even covers the top. And here is the shin armor. Tons of coverage, the most coverage area that I've seen so far in the business. And it feels great in the suit. I love this feature in all their suits. They've done a fantastic job with that. Here is the race hump on the SP1. It's hollowed out and channeled. Liner for the SP1. The first note I'm going to give you is this. This can be washed. Please do it on a gentle cycle, no harsh detergents, and do not ever throw this in the dryer. Line dry it, let it dry slowly. There is a pocket sewn into the liner that holds our shoulder armor. I'm going to go ahead and slide that out real quick. CE certified, same style as the rest of the armor we've shown you, hard outer GP shell, energy absorbing foam, large coverage area. We have some additional foam padding for protection sewn into the liner here in the upper arm. And down here in the quads and the hips. Let's go to the shell of the suit itself. Okay? We showed you that channel race hump. Now the top of the race hump on the actual shell of the suit is perforated. When you're in a tuck, air drives in here, in through the channels on the hump, gigantic air conditioner. The collar of the suit is done in a mixture of neoprene and leather. It's very comfortable. You can see the back of the collar 
offers a little mesh panel that's a hot spot it allows the heat energy to escape or to keep it cool and comfortable let's look at our stretch panels here We've got a stretch panel here in the back of the shoulder some additional foam padding here in the shoulder blade area a little additional perf here underneath that stretch panel a little additional perf here in the back of the upper arm a little additional perforation here just above the waist in the back here is that stretch panel in the back area we've got an additional foam pad sewn in here in the seat this suit also offers the option for the calf expansion you know if you have large calves need some more room you can zip that panel open gives you another inch or so accommodate those big calves another thing the Alpine Star suits all come with now is chest armor okay we think it's a great addition installed in a suit right now we have just kind of a medium density energy absorbing foam this can be upgraded to the Alpine Stars bionic chest armor with a hard outer GP shell very affordable and it's a great way to protect the front of yourself remember the back is important so is the front moving on from that this suit does not include a back protector there's only two suits in the Alpine Star range that do the race replica and the MX-1 all of the other suits, SP1 being included in that, you'll need to purchase a back protector. We have some great stuff here from Alpine Stars, Knox, Bond, Dynasty, all kinds of great choices. Our staff is fully versed on each and every one. Make sure you pick one up with the suit, you're going to need it. This is the SP1 leather suit. It's one of our favorites. I'm Brian Van from SportBikeTrackGear.com.